Sandy, Amazon rainforest where it rains 365 days of the year. I know it sounds like a lot and you're kind of right. You know, some years it rains almost every day. It's just crazy, I know. Um, around the bend here, you'll see the beautiful inspiration falls though. Go ahead guys, take a moment, take a gander, let it all sink in. Uh, people do often wonder how inspiration falls got its name. You see, the legend states that if you stare into the falls for long enough, you'll feel really inspired to go deeper and deeper into the jungle, of course. So that's what we're going to do. Well, but before we go any further, has anyone here seen the Jungle Book lately? Jungle Book, ring a bell? A few of us. Good. All right. If you guys haven't seen it, don't worry. It's cool. It's right there. The Jungle Book. Yeah. Now we've all seen it together. No more excuses, right? Um, but I did try to arrange a really special pygmy welcome party for you up here on the beach. I decorated and invited all my friends over. It looks really great, I know. But um, yeah, I can't see anyone. Canoe? No, it's so awkward. I feel like I'm reliving my Sweet 16 all over again. Seriously, it's just tragic, yeah. But look, at least this big guy's still hanging around. Yeah, some of you might think he looks scary, but he's actually really friendly. If you're lucky, he might even develop a really big crush on you. I'm sorry, buddy. No one wants to be wrapped up in a constricting relationship. Okay, you're starting to smother me. Uh, my camp's out. If you want to swing by and grab some snake repellent or some snacks. Or... Oh, no. Maybe we should just keep going. Wow, that doesn't look good. Um... I guess it's not all bad news. I couldn't get my Jeep to start. At least they got it to turn over, right? They probably had to use a monkey wrench on that one. Maybe they just called Triple A. Honestly, who's to say? All right, now guys, we're moving on to the Nile River next. The Nile River is the longest river in the world. Yeah, someone once told me it goes on for Niles and Niles and Niles. But if you don't believe me, it's cool. I get it. You're just in denial. Yeah. Now that right there is an African bull elephant. If you don't know how to tell he's an African elephant, it's really easy. Don't worry. It's because we're in Africa. Yeah. I thought this one a trick. Hey, buddy, speak. Louder. Hey, good boy. Now spray the boat. I guess we're still working on that one. Um, but don't miss that sandstone rock formation, okay? I really have to point it out. Most people tend to take it for granted. It's one of our bolder attractions, though. It really rocks, right? <laughs> now, if you look up on the hill, you'll see all sorts of critters coming together drink of water. Giraffes, gazelles, canoes. Oh, wow, a whole pride of lions. Oh, they are such sweethearts. The way they're babysitting that sleeping fever, right? <laughs> Don't worry, kids. That's how all zebras sleep. On their sides. Their necks slightly bent. Why are you making those faces? It's fine. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Look at that, guys. There's got to be like a million rocks on that beach. It's incredible. Okay, we lost a safari group last week. Tried to warn them they wouldn't be able to outrun a rhinoceros on foot, but uh, I think it's safe to say they'll probably get the point in the end on that one. Yeah. I wouldn't want to be the low man on that total bull, right? Now, over here on the bank, you'll see some of our oldest residents here in the jungle. On the left, that's Smiley. On the right, his girlfriend, Ginger. Believe it or not, they're celebrating their 50th anniversary, yeah. Ginger told Smiley that all she really wanted this year was a slow cooker, but um, you all know that's just a crock, right? All right, now, so you're going to have that Schweitzer Falls, named after the famous Dr. Albert um, Falls. <laughs> uh, looks like this might be a bit of a tight one. Um, you guys on that side of the boat, you probably want to lean a little bit. A nice cool mist that's covering your face. It's home to about 800 species of jungle bacteria. Wow, isn't that refreshing, yeah. But I guess you could be starting to wonder how in the world they landed a job here. Guys, I think it should be pretty plain to see. I took a crash course. Yeah, no, I'm just sort of winging it, but honestly, that's just the tail end of the story. Don't worry too much about the rest. It's clear to see my career's yet to take off, right? <laughs> oh, hippos. Oh, they're coming from everywhere. This is not good, guys. I know, you might think they're cute and cuddly, but these are hungry, hungry hippos. They can easily take down a boat like this. You know, just last week, the company actually launched boats to hippo attacks. Whew. Don't worry too much, guys, honestly. Only five of those boats are mine. It's no big deal. Except I don't think we're out of the woods just yet. Okay, it does look like we found ourselves in headhunter territory. Now, I've been told this is a really terrible place to be headed, but don't take my word for it. Ask my last crew over there. They were a bunch of boneheads, yeah. Now, you know when the natives dance in a circle like this, it can usually only mean one or two things. Either they forgot how to do a square dance, or they're planning to attack us.
treasure, but it might also lead to danger. So everyone, just keep your eyes open. I'm closing mine. in the middle of a secret Indian elephant bathing pool. Wow. Uh, now go ahead guys, take out your cameras. I mean, honestly, feel free to take all the photos you'd like in here. I think they all have their trunks on today. Uh, actually, it looks like there's a whole family of elephants hanging out. Got mamas and babies all splashing around. Someone's even in the shower. It is super cute, I know. This gives you have a bit of a reputation though. Looks like this one's trying to spray down our phone. I'm gonna try to sneak on past him. I don't think you'll have a chance to reload. Why is he coming up? No! Everybody duck! 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 duck. Goose. Oh. Um, I guess they forgot to pack their trunks that time. You could say that's just a bit of dry humor for you, but uh, I gotta tell you, people really think that they have water in their trunks. It's not. Isn't that nice yet? Now I guess no trip to the jungle is complete without a quick stop to our head salesman, Trader Sam. He's right up here. You see, Lately, sales have been really shrinking for Sam, so he's offering a great special today. Right now, you can get any two of his heads for just one of yours. <laughs> any takers on that deal? No. No? Oh, come on, guys. Anyway, you slice it or dice it, you're really sure to come out ahead on that one, right? <laughs> Alrighty, well, as we pull up to the dock, make sure everyone's fully seated with your arms, hands, legs, and feet inside the boat. Please make sure you exit the same way you came in. Don't cross the center crates. I don't want anyone to trip. I'd make for two bad trips in the boat. I'm only held responsible for the first one. <laughs> All right, guys, we laughed, we cried. I think we very nearly died. A lot of people say that stuff makes us a lot like a family. But like a real family, I think we can agree. Sometimes 10 minutes together is enough. So get out.